All right, Micah, we've been talking about gambling. You made a $2 bet, you won $160. Yeah, I'm pretty good. Imagine you made a $2 bet on the pick five for the lottery, didn't even know it, and then looked in your wallet and you had won $242,000. That's fucking sick. How long was it? A Michigan lottery player said he was unaware that he won $242,256 jackpot until he came across some forgotten tickets in his wallet. The 65-year-old Oakland County man told the Michigan lottery officials he decided to buy some tickets April 30th for the Fantasy Five drawing from the BP gas station in Clawson after making note of the large jackpot. Isn't that interesting? That's all story? Is that he won the lottery? Here's, here's, here's man him. Man wins lottery? This is him, and I'll do my impression of what I think he sounds like. What If you fucking do a racial voice, I swear to God, Tim... When I was cashing out my my gas station, I saw a Fantasy Five jackpot was over two hundred thousand dollars. So I decided to purchase a few tickets. The man said, <laughs> "I forgot I had purchased the tickets until I saw them in my wallet a few days later." He said, "Where is this from?" This is in Oakland County, Michigan. Yeah, that's how they sound in Oakland County, Michigan. Dude, Michigan people sound fucking dumb as fuck. Have they you sound ever- southern. Oakland County, Michigan is probably like, like not, it's like sprawl. Here's the thing. Any hill people or like people that kind of live on their own all sound like white trash. That's what I assume white trash people sound like. You, and Tim, we don't know where he was you born. Wanna, you want them to sound white trash, just use your voice. No, I speak eloquently. <laughs> okay. I speak like an eloquent debutante out on the town. Hello, I would like a soup fork, please. <laughs> soup fork? <laughs> my soup is not staying in my spoon. I would like a fork for it, please. <laughs> the man checked his ticket using the Michigan Lottery app and was shocked to see the ticket bearing the numbers 14, 16, 25, 29, 39, my measurements, and had won. <laughs> <laughs> And then won $242,000. I couldn't believe what I was seeing, the winner recalled. I decided to get my computer and check the numbers on the lottery website to make sure there wasn't a glitch on the app. Oh my God, Tim, stop. (laughs) Tim. All right, that's the end. What, 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 what do you, did he say what he was going to spend it on? That's all anybody wants to know. I'm I'm going to spend this on dip. He's going to get chaws for him. Dip, 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 dip. Well, that's a fun story that kind of sucked and didn't go anywhere. (laughs) I didn't read it ahead of time. I just what the fuck, Tim? I thought it would go along with our gambling talk from earlier. Tim, you you did a weird news story that you didn't read, (laughs) and the weird headline was a man won the lottery, the local lottery. After it's not even one of those like fucking half a billion ones. It's like half. It's a quarter of a million, which honestly can't even buy you a house in New York. Yeah, but it couldn't get him a house. He could, he could get like six trailers stacked on top of each other in fucking Oakland County, Michigan. Tim, I bet he lives better than you. Oh, I bet he lives better than both of us. Did you look up Oakland County, Michigan? Probably know that's no, a rich town. I bet it's not. Oakland. Rich people County, forget they have lottery tickets. Michigan. Let's see. Where is it? It's by Troy and Livonia. Oh, it actually might be. <laughs> I rest my motherfucking case. How many times have you been wrong on this podcast? First. Oh, it's Auburn Hills, isn't it? Auburn Hills has like a lot of money. Okay, well. All right, well, I take back what I was saying. The rich keep getting richer. The rich get richer. This guy's just going to stuff it in his coffers and go fucking play some damn golf. Yeah. Well, Micah, we got to get to our next segment. That was our very rousing news segment. Tim, I think it's making the show flow pretty well, though. Whether or not the whether or not the news was good, I think the show is flowing well. The news sucked my dick. <laughs> well, maybe next week I'll come up with better news. Okay. 